In this video we are going to talk about 20 safe dividend stocks. So before starting, please like this video and subscribe to this channel for our future updates. Outperformance is usually driven by dividend increases rather than yield. As a result, these safe dividend stocks provide you with more than simple safety. Number 12. Morgan Stanley. Investment bank Morgan Stanley, MS, $100.66, is known for its technical deals. Buying Smith Barney, E-Trade Financial, and Eaton Vance puts the company into wealth management. The analyst recently wrote, Client growth in wealth management, cost savings, and $12 billion in share repurchases over the next four quarters are expected to bolster the stock. He expects two more Fed rate hikes to raise margins by 2% by 2023. Its dividend of 2.8% was quadrupled to 70 cents per share. Then a $1 dividend in two years. An analyst estimates a $115 price. In addition, Morgan Stanley has a five-year payout increase score of 9 and a free cash flow to dividend ratio of 288.5%. Number 11. Nextar Media Group. It owns 199 TV stations in 39 states and 50 DMAs, designated market areas, or regions where Nielsen measures local TV viewing. Nextar stations reach 38% of us TV households, 82.5 million. In September 2020, the company will launch News Nation. Balanced news coverage based on facts. They have 94 million monthly visits and 120 local websites. The firm recently acquired The Hill. That's what Nextar calls balanced. Buy from Deutsche Bank's Connor Murphy. Due to its scale, it may negotiate retransmission consent fees and reverse compensation with broadcast networks. A shareholder-friendly plan is also Nextar's. The company's second quarter net revenue grew 24% to $1.13 billion. Profit increased to $199.8 million. Year on year, free cash flow was $181.2 million, up 111% from the third quarter of 2019. TV ad revenue grew by 35% to $432 million. NXST has a 474% free cash flow to dividend ratio and an EPS growth rate of 223.3%. Number 10. Goldman Sachs. One analyst likes Goldman Sachs, GS, $407.89 last year, the famed investment bank outperformed consensus earnings expectations 75% of the time. Goldman's expected dividend increase is 58.9%, one of the highest among its safe dividend payers. Furthermore, it is expected to increase its earnings per share by 149.2% over the next five years. Cash and cash equivalents totaled $212 billion as of September 30. Michael Wong of Morningstar said Goldman's approach has been to grow revenue by $2 to $3 billion at current businesses and $1 to $2 billion at new operations. For $1.9 billion, NN Investment Partners, a Dutch asset manager with $355 billion in assets under management, was acquired. Number 9. Jeffries Financial Group. Jeffries, 42.05, Jeff, $42.05, finance for real estate and automobiles are among its activities. According to Morningstar, Jeff is also involved in gold and silver mining, auto dealerships, and broadband services. The firm's business diversity had little financial impact. Jeffries reported $1.65 billion in net sales for the third quarter. It was up 19% from the same quarter in 2020, which set a net sales record. Adjusted EPS was $1.50, up 40% year-on-year. Why Jefferies is a safe dividend stock to own, Jeff is expected to have an FCF to dividend ratio of 1.395 and EPS growth of 233%. The bank pays a 2.4% dividend. It has increased dividends four times in the last five years, most recently by 25% in June. According to recent creditor presentations, its trade inventory is also liquid and low-risk. Assets total $52.2 billion. 
The company's trailing 12-month P-E ratio of 7.0 is much below the SNM P500 average of 28.6. At $45.13, Morningstar feels Jefferies is still cheap. Number 8. Ally Financial. One of the major auto lending companies in the US is Ally Financial, Ally, $55.81. Ally Bank, Ally Invest, and Ally Insurance are all subsidiaries of Ally Financial. The company's balance sheet is strong, with $13.1 billion in cash and cash equivalents at the end of the third quarter of 2021. In the last six quarters, Ally Financial has beaten Wall Street estimates. Its forward price-to-earnings ratio is 8.4, versus 21 for the S and MP P500. That makes Ally one of the cheapest secure dividend stocks. Number 7. Target. Target, TGT, $251.83, has the most millennial. An urban hipster mind share of any general merchandise big box retailer. In the last five years, the stock has increased by 260%. The average analyst recommendation for TGT tracked by S&P Global Market Intelligence is buy with conviction. Objective has a buy recommendation from independent research group CRA, with a 12-month price target of $300. Target can continue to execute on numerous strategies aimed at boosting growth, the corporation says. It expects good results from a robust back-to-school buying season and in areas like beauty, clothes, luggage, and travel. However, the CRA feels Target's inventory levels are healthy, up 26% year-over-year, and it has levers to manage prices to keep products affordable. Number 6. Lowe's. The epidemic is increasing the appeal of making homes more useful and comfortable for those who work from home, boosting the home renovation business. This helps Lowe's, low, $225.01, the world's second-largest home improvement retailer. Lowe's has a flawless five-year dividend score of 10, a Divkin expected dividend growth of 23.1%, a free cash flow-to-dividend ratio of 330.4%, an Altman Z-score of 4.4, and an Altman Z-score of 4.4. Due to the loss of the Orchard Supply brand and Mexican assets, Increasing capital expenditures will focus on areas that should contribute to better working capital utilization. Number 5. Hershey. Candy maker Hershey's HSY, $180.19, has a sweet story to tell. Not only does this famed American business make its own chocolate bars, but it also makes Reese's peanut butter cups and almond joys. No wonder it's one of North America's largest chocolate producers. The company is based in Hershey, Pennsylvania, where Willy Wonka-themed attractions include the Hotel Hershey's Spa, which offers whipped cocoa baths and chocolate fondue body wraps, and Hershey Park offers thrill rides and a museum. But dividend investors should prefer Hershey for similar reasons. Divkin has a 5-year dividend score of 10 and an Altman Z-score of 7.0. Plus, this secure dividend stock increased its quarterly payout by 12.1% in July. Number 4. Stanley Black & Decker. SWK, $187.57. Supplies industrial equipment and provides security. SWK announced in August that it would buy the remaining 80% of MTD holdings for $1.6 billion. MTD also offers Robomo, a robotic lawn mower similar to a Roomba for lawns. 2020 will bring approximately $17 billion. Management's $1 plus per share forecast for 2025 is conservative, according to UBS analyst Marcus Mittermeier. Also, the stock is cheap. SWK's second quarter profits beat expectations, retaining the analysts by rating. Stanley Black & Decker's 12-month consensus P/E ratio is roughly a decade low compared to the S&P 500. He expects the stock to normalize. Number 3. Evercore. According to the company's website, its wealth management business managed $11 billion in assets as of June 30. Evercore stated it grew adjusted EPS by 24% over five years and adjusted net revenue by 13%. Evercore has an outstanding history of beating profit expectations, 
particularly in the last four quarters. Evercore's initiatives to strengthen the investment banking area are strategic. Number 2. United Parcel Service. United Parcel Service, UPS, $195.27, pays a safe dividend. Consider that the company paid out $3.6 billion in dividends in 2020, representing a 5.2% increase per share. On top of that, UPS paid out $1.7 billion in dividends to stockholders in the first half of 2021, up 75% from the same period in 2020. Five-year dividend growth is 10%, with 120.6 EPS growth and a 10 Divkin five-year dividend score. UPS Z-score is 4.6. UPS reported a 14.5% increase in sales to $23.4 billion and a 50% increase in earnings per share to $3.05. Deliveries increased during the pandemic as more people shopped online, but this trend may moderate as the economy recovers. UPS and FedEx dominate parcel delivery in the United States. Number 1. HP. To be confused with Hewlett Packard Enterprise, HPE, HP's, HPQ, $28.59, printing division houses one of Silicon Valley's founding granddaddies. HPE focuses on servers, the cloud, storage, software, and other services. PC sales generate roughly two-thirds of total revenue and half of operational profitability for HP. Despite this, after spending, loan interest, taxes, and long-term investments, the corporation generated high free cash flow, FCF. HPQ increased its dividend by 28% to $1 per share. With a free cash flow to dividend ratio of 602.7% and a perfect five-year dividend score of 10, HPQ is a safe dividend stock. What do you think about our video? Please let us know in the comments area below. If you enjoyed this video and would want to hear from me again, please subscribe and turn on the notification before leaving. Thank you for watching us.